Today on Waza Wednesday, we're going to be taking a look at some application from the Kata Goren. The movement is a cross hand punch followed by both hands pulling down. Now even if you don't work this kata, you're still going to pick up some great concepts from the hands crossing and also from both arms pulling down. Alright, so sometimes in kata our hands cross. That doesn't necessarily mean that in the fight I'm crossing my hands. I could be literally crossing my hand with his. Now the punch is coming over the top which makes this crossed hand position that you're seeing. So there's a couple different ways to look at this. One is our hands crossing. Two is this punch coming over the top. Now when that hand crosses, I could also hit with that first initial punch and then follow with the second punch. But I don't wanna knock him back that far for my next technique, which is the arms pulling down. As the arms pull down, I'm gonna step in and trap his arm so that I have a break here with my body and with his arm. Okay, so again, what that looks like is punch, step through deep and push down for the break. And then this hand can be striking. Okay, so again, punch and strike. Now, if I step through first, this can also be pushing back as this breaks and gives you a little different throw. Another thing you can do from here when you step in for this break is turn your body. Now you're gonna be more throwing him, which can lead to other follow-ups. So again, when I have this arm locked up in this position, all I have to do is take a step and turn, and then I get his momentum going to where he can be thrown into a wall or a strike. Let's take a look at that last part from this side. So as he comes in, you punch and strike. Now you can turn and throw him in to your next strike or your next throw as well. So again, you see these cross hand positions. Sometimes it's blocking and punching over or pushing and punching under. You may not have noticed on that takedown, but once I had my partner down, I held his head and then punched underneath my hand to hit to the neck. 